It's senior night, and we're at the fish tank. I'm Michael David with Ion Sun Valley Sports, coming to you from the community school in Sun Valley, Idaho, where tonight the Cutthroats take on their rivals, the Richfield Tigers. Get ready for the exciting volleyball action. <laughs>
the cut three to nothing. Thank you for your support of the cut throat. We're down on the court at the fish tank where we just watched the Sun Valley Community School Cutthroats finish off their regular season in winning fashion, defeating the Richfield Tigers. And I'm so fortunate to be joined by Blakely Spohr, Katie Worley, Lola Street, and Coach Kristen Rutland. Congratulations, you guys. Blakely, you, you guys maybe were shaking off a little uh, pre-game. Yeah. She kind of senior night jitters. What was the key to getting back in that first set? Um, I think for me it's just really about taking the noise and turning it into something good and using it as energy and then also just playing for your teammates. I think that's a huge thing as well. So I think just we love each other, so we just played for each other and that was really fun. That's awesome. Katie, it was it was a packed, a packed fish tank. Um, does that make a difference for you? Can you can you feel that when you're out on the court? Absolutely. You can definitely feel the energy from the crowd and it's really helpful having people cheer you on and it helps our team dynamic. Right now, Lola, you're watching your seniors being recognized. Um, what, what was the key for you to, to you guys getting off to a great start? Um, I think it was just for all of us to have like a positive attitude and knowing that this is like kind of the end of our season, just trying to have as much fun and connect as much as we can as a team. Right. And you, you two as seniors out there, are you, are you more vocal or are you just kind of leading by example? Um, I think I would say we're leading more by example, just Hopefully doing <laughs> Yeah, definitely a good combination, so that's what I think. Yeah. Right, right. Coach, a uh, couple words about this team. They're playing good. There's a lot of good good playing going on in this conference. Uh, t talk about these ladies. Uh, you know, we're, re we're really excited to go into the postseason. I feel like we are finally coming together and everybody's kind of stepping up and our pieces are, are melding. So we are, we're really excited to play the next couple days. So to see what we can do. That's great, Katie. What, what did you see out there that you liked? Uh, maybe even some things that, uh, that you guys will work on as you, as you head into the districts. Um, I think this game, we did a really good job of coming together as a team and just cheering for each other and um, like hyping each other up. Um, I think we can always work on defense. But I think we played really well this game. That's great, Lola. What do you what do you have to say about your these four seniors that uh, that were out there leading the way? Uh, they're definitely going to be missed. Um, I don't know. Honestly, <laughs> I just love playing with them. They all have great attitudes. They all have killer swings and killer serves, and they're for sure going to be missed. Well, that's awesome. Thanks for joining me. Good luck in the postseason, ladies. Thank you. Thank you. I'm Michael David with Eye on Sun Valley Sports, keeping my eye on Wood River Valley Sports for you. Better food, better price, better service. Atkinson's Market, supporting local farmers since 1956. As a family doctor, I see patients of all ages with sports injuries and repetitive use problems. I'm Dr. Tom Archie, and I'd like to introduce you to the Class 4 Cold Laser. I often combine laser with acupuncture and physical therapy to enhance the healing of sore tendons, ligaments, and joints. Research indicates the Class 4 cold laser may speed recovery from concussion as well. It's safe and innovative. Visit us at innerhealthmd.com or call 208-578-4550. Family medicine like it used to be, affordable, personal, and looking to the future.